We can't live in a simulation and also be in a universe that lives and breathes. Pick one, it's not both. I know the fabric of space and time seem to be stretching farther than Mitch McConnell's jowls, but follow me on this one. If this is a simulation, do me a favor, slap yourself in the face. Feels pretty real, right? But if you think the universe is a living, breathing entity that is thinking about you manifesting your destiny or whatever, not only is that not a healing crystal you're carrying, it's a coke rock and you're crazy. The universe doesn't give a fuck about you. It's too busy expanding by overeating Froyo to forget its own problems. <laughs> In times of tribulation, we tend to ask ourselves, is you or is you ain't? Thank you, screaming autistic Viking. Really appreciate the input. Maybe stop deep throating death. It's blocking your throat chakra. Ugh, I'm starting to regret this idea. I feel like Elvis sitting on a toilet. I don't have a solution for this feeling, but a few suggestions to maybe quell it. Do enough mushrooms to see into another dimension and embrace druidism. Seek a therapist because having a therapist is like so in right now. Put those Jesus ho slides, tear up your social security card, and become one with the dirt. If you can manage to get to that little sweet spot known as the fuck it stage, detach yourself from the media. They're only trying to keep you scared. Or you can repost profound quotes on your social media and simply pretend to be okay. Namaste or namago. Your choice. Lady, I am providing humorous content for the internet. Can you go be a Karen somewhere else?